Uh, we actually have some vitamin questions coming in. So Chandra says, I heard that vitamin C in massive doses is good for cancer patients. Is this true? So vitamin C is one of those antioxidants like I talked about. Um, so they're going to fight against the free radicals that cause damage to the DNA in our cells. Um, I would strongly caution against taking large doses of any vitamin. Um, the Because it is an antioxidant, um, it's going to, the mechanism that it works by can sometimes interfere with different cancer treatments actually. So if you're on a certain kind of cancer treatment and you're taking super high vitamin C, it can make the, vi make the cancer treatment less effective. Um, your body doesn't need mega doses of anything. It needs just the right amount of everything. Um, so if vitamin C is something that you're worried about, um, you know, you can always eat food sources that are really high in vitamin C, um, strawberries, red bell peppers, oranges, obviously, um, I think broccoli is weirdly high in vitamin C. Um, and those food sources, you're only, your body is only going to absorb as much as you need. And then you're also going to get the benefit of the fiber and all of the other different antioxidants and phytonutrients that are in those, those foods as well. Um, if you do feel like you need to take a supplement, I would say just a regular multivitamin is fine for most people. Um, it's going to have, you know, about like a hundred percent of every, you know, vitamin that you need, and that should be just fine. Um, there's vitamin C is water soluble, meaning that it, it clings onto water in your body. And if there's extra, you just pee out the extra, but those mega doses, I would strongly caution against, especially, um, vitamin A, E, and C. Those ones are going to be not good to take in mega doses.